Today I was actually continuing to do some um, some cleanup on my website uh, keisha.com for those who don't know since I've had the foresight that something was about to be wrong with my Instagram so what I've been doing I've been working on uh, you know my presence online and so this is my website, uh, Keisha.com. So what I've been doing, I moved all my domains uh, to point to this place, which will be where, you know, it's not just going to be uh, CD releases. As you can see now, you have uh, some NFT art now. Um, so this is where you can buy my art now. You're going to be able to just have a link and you can mint directly in foundation for example where you have this art thank you Chaz wesley for minting this one uh then you have the shows so you can go to keisha.com to see the latest photoshop for my show my last show here in lisbon as you can see you have a bunch of nice photos of of the actual show and i will soon add um to this i will soon add the video of the show once it's there and if you go here if you click here uh it's taking you to uh all the live all the events uh so i've been uploading a lot of galleries that i was leaving on uh, on facebook uh, and i'm taking everything back to where I am. So this is my latest gallery that I uploaded today. It was me in uh, March 2015 in Kinshasa. So that's my son 10 years ago. He was 11 uh, with all his dogs. That's me and my little brother. Uh, yeah, and you can, you know, you can see uh, Yeah, it's a nice gallery this is me in my parents house uh so yeah that's me and my dad at his office when he was at the senate oh that's my dad working at the senate i think we have a picture together where is he there he is so yeah you can go and check that out and if you click again it takes you back to the rest of the photos so I'm, I'm uploading, I have a, a ton of content to upload to the website, but then once I'm done, it's just gonna be everything in that place. Of course, you have uh, my new single with Fina called La Somme de Memo. You can also uh, directly listen. If you have a Spotify account, you can directly play straight from the website. Or if you don't, you can uh, just uh, click here and it will take you to a list of stores when you can listen to. So that's the update on uh, sushiro.com, keisha.com. So the good thing is now, for now, it says uh, sro.co, but it's just, it's soon gonna just be keisha.com. And if you type any of my, and I have a lot of them. So if you type, for example, uh, danza kizomba.co, it is taking you here. If you type, Keisha.com. Oops. You should type Keisha.com. Really? Oh, Lord. Not Asia.com. <laughs> if you type Keisha.com. The hell? Advance. Proceed. Don't tell me that my site is unsafe. It's, it's taking you there. I, it's because the site is in the middle of migration. So that's why it's unsafe right now. But soon everything will point to Keisha.com. Um, if you type uh, srfamily.com, it will still take you here. If you type sushi raw life, life.com, it will take you here. If you type blackbuddhamusic.com, it will take you here. So that's what I've been doing. Uh, 
and uh, I'm not gonna say what is my next move, but my next move is gonna be crazy. But yeah, go visit Keisha.com. Uh, you will love it. You have uh, the new NFT website is uh, almost ready. You have uh, Shadowware when you can buy all my all my stuff. We have a brand new uh, brand new Ponawai Ponawai hoodies. You have to check them out. Uh, and then uh, then you have, of course, you have Club Shada, for example. So you can directly watch Club Shada straight from the website uh, if you keep play stuff. You see, we're gonna you're gonna be able to to see the straight from this page. So that's cool. And you have a, a a list of all the the old the last two hundred episodes that you can watch directly from the website. So that is cool. And then you have uh, the Keisha page where you have access to all my all the places where I live online, which is X, TikTok, and Vero. In meta, I'm persona non grata. <laughs> These bastards. Oh, Lord. Wow. Wait a minute. The live is over and I can still see comments? What happened? Wow. Hmm. Listen, um... I want to talk a little, just a little bit about uh, my presence on uh, on TikTok. Um, so when I was banned from uh, Instagram, I had uh, 158,000 followers on TikTok and uh, 170 on on Instagram. And in 15 days, I now have 167,000 on TikTok. So in three, I'm going to have the same amount of followers on on TikTok. If it's, even if it's not the same, I'm starting to add different content content there. I'm starting to add shows. I'm starting to, to post photos as well. Um, but uh, again, uh, I'm not using any platform uh, to replace my presence in my own website. Uh, but it's interesting. Something interesting as well is that um, usually when we do a Club Shadow episode, we have around 200 people watching. Uh, my last live, let me see. Can I see a uh, live center? My last live, uh, can I see the stats? Oh no, that's not what I'm trying to do. My last live, uh, be, listen, my last live, I had 6,500 people watching and I received 7,000 diamonds which I believe is the equivalent of 40, 40 euros in donations. And that's from probably being live three or four times. But listen, if I was live from my calculation, right? If I had live on TikTok with this regularity, let's say 10 times a month, at, at the pace that I am now, I would make 500 uh, euros, $500 every month. So imagine if you just multiply these numbers by 10. Now, TikTok becomes a very interesting business. Uh, but then it just depends the quality of your followers. Uh, and... If you have people that are, are here donating stuff because 
they enjoy uh, the content. So it's interesting uh, and uh, the engagement is crazy. And I believe that YouTube should actually take a page out of that because these are platforms that, that are making it um, easy for you to go live and have people come see you and people share and people enter. And so uh, it's very interesting. Of course, I really had some person that really did a lot of donation uh, that night. But um, yeah, imagine you have like 10 people like those every life. It becomes crazy. Uh, what else did I want to show you about my TikTok? Um, uh, analytics. Um, so I make around uh, every month now. I make around 2 million views uh, from my TikTok uh, videos. Um, and what is interesting is that if you look at the content, right? Now I get like uh, between 2,000 and 1,000 views per video. And some videos, they've trend a little bit. And some of them go 20,000. And some of them go 30. Some of them go 100,000, right? And you can see in the ones that are trending, like this one, for example, 65,000. The one with Tony Sad, 82,000. And my son, this one with uh, almost 100,000. Um, what it is creating and what I've been uh, experiencing is that let's take, for example, this video where I'm performing uh, my brand new song. Uh, this one, for example. So this is my brand new song, uh, La Somme de Memo with uh, Faina, right? And uh, so you see, everybody is discovering the track. Okay, cool. But now what is interesting is that if you click on this, so you see my videos, right? Because it's a new song. But let's take um uh, let me see it's not this one uh let me see for example me listening to uh the new version of something going on right so from this right of me listening to my own track and having uh 1.7 thousand comments and i think a million views right yeah a million a million views uh so if i click on this new version i already have three thousand videos meaning that i'm starting to be able to create my own little trends from my own tracks and imagine if I just do some Guyad solos that belong to me and do videos of me listening to it. I can create other trends like this. So this is me listening to my track, uh, for example, um, 88 BPM, right? And then I had a million views. And if I click on the song, now you have 2,400 videos of people listening to that song and it translates directly into uh people that are going to uh, it translates directly into people that then all go to listen to the track on youtube or on the streaming platforms so that's very interesting and I had my, uh, the latest one that trended was this one of me listening to my track Love de Toi with 500,000 views. And if you listen, see, 600 videos done from that. So the thing is interesting. Most of the people, they go on this platform 
to trend using songs that belong to other people. I go on these platform and I create trends with my own songs, then generate stream from my own songs. So this is a very interesting loop. So yeah, TikTok, very interesting.